everybody, Joe here with uh, Canada at the Movies. This time I would like to present and review the movie She Said, which is a drama slash a biography film. And it stars Zoe Kazan uh, Carrie, and Carrie Mulligan, but it also has as side characters who, um, you know, some celebrities that I don't want to leave out or ignore because they did have a uh, part of the plot as well. Ashley Judd and um, Andre Brar. Now, this point film is about two New York, uh, is it New York Times? I think it was New York Times, um, not The Post. So two New York Times um, uh, reporters that were looking into different scandals and they ended up um, talking about Harvey Weinstein. Uh, the um, and you know this was a pretty uh, titular um, time um, and 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 uh, person, um, and this actually started the Me Too movement. Now, that's what the film is all about. So the plot actually happened in real life. So there's no spoilers there. If you want to know about the plot, you can either see this movie or you can read about the journalists who reported on um, the Harvey Weinstein scandal and how they ended up getting the information that they needed before they published it. Now, the movie itself, I mean, the plot was the plot, but there was a lot of unnecessary information in there. And then there was some information in there that I would have liked to see. As far as, um, you know, the, the acting, again, these, these are journalists. Um, so of course they overacted, they overdramatized, um, which I can appreciate, you know, as a thespian, um, there was a lot of uh, tears and, you know, just, they acted their butts off, okay? Like I, I gotta give it to the actors and actresses. They acted their butts off. They were convicted. There was a lot of conviction there, and I appreciate that. So I'll have to give that a high score as far as that goes. Y'all did a wonderful job. All the actors and actresses maybe deserve a nomination for the amount of emotions that they were able to bring out um, You know, during that time. They, they really were dedicated to that. Now, um, there were, again, a lot of unnecessary scenes. Um, of course, you know, they wanted to show a lot of the beautiful things that they were doing because it was the film was set primarily in New York, but they also ended up going over to overseas and over to California as well. And they did show a lot of beautiful, uh, you know, shots and everything like that. But I just feel like they were just time fillers. So because of that, um, you know, this, this movie was uh, two hours long. It could have been shorter. Um, because of that, I kind of feel like a part of my time was wasted there because it just wasn't necessary. Um, so overall, I would have to give this uh, movie a B minus because of those things that I was talking about. Um, I'm not going to say it was average or below because, again, the plot was good, as you know, and they, they followed the plot as well as they could. Um, and the actors and actresses did a wonderful job. Um, I just felt like there were certain parts that, you know, maybe they should have fixed in post and gone back and saying, hey, is this really necessary for the story that we're trying to tell? And maybe added a bit more on the fam familial side of the journalists to show what these um, threats of violence and things like that were doing to the journalists. I would have loved to see that, but unfortunately I don't feel like we got enough of that. So that's the reason for my score. So let me know uh, down in the comments below if you've seen this movie or if you haven't, um, let me know if you want to go see it. Um, I would love to discuss. So let me know. Everybody have a happy Thanksgiving. Again, I've been Joe with Candidate the Movies. Please click that like, share, and subscribe as well as hit that notification bell. And I'll check you all later. Have a fantastic day. Peace.